Hello Internet, and welcome to Merman's Archery Adventures. Okay, so continuing our Archery 101 series, today we're just going to have a little look at how to wax a bowstring. Um, something very simple, um, but the first thing you are going to need is some wax. So we have some wax right here. Um, it comes in a variety of, uh, of scents and different types of wax nowadays. Um, you can get silicon infused wax or you can get these which um, sense and feel wax which uh, they smell of things. Um, this one smells of the forest. That's actually not, it's quite nice actually. Yeah, I like that one. And then you've got this one which smells, this one smells of energy. So that's what energy smells like. Right, anyway, but what we are going to be using is just a very simple standard wax. Um, most waxes nowadays come in a tube. Um, you can get some that come in a tin or uh, even like a little block of, of solid beeswax all do pretty much the same sort of thing. Um, so yeah, what you want to be doing is uh, popping the, the lid off and then you just push it up like a, I don't know, like a print stick or something. Now you can apply it in a couple of different ways. You can run it up and down the string uh, like that, although that does create a bit of a groove in, in the wax, um, or you could rub it on like this. It doesn't really matter as long as you put plenty of wax on your string. Now I do get asked uh, a fair bit about how often you should wax, um, wax a string. I, I say you can't wax a string enough, but you want to be waxing it at least once a week um, if, if you're shooting fairly regularly. It's just going to drastically increase the lifespan of, um, of your bowstring. But, uh, but anyway, uh, I, I've applied plenty of wax onto that string there. Then all you do is take your fingers and just rub it in. Give it a nice, uh, nice rub. And what you're doing, you're, you're heating that wax up with the friction from your fingers, uh, and it's sort of permeating the... Um, uh, the, the fibers of the string, so it's uh, it's conditioning the, the the string really, as well as coating the outside. You, you're also conditioning the inside of the string. But um, but yeah, once you've done that, uh, I know quite a few people that just leave it leave it like that. But uh, I'll show you how to take the uh, the excess off in a second. If you can avoid the serving as well, um, especially for your compound archer, you don't want to get sort of um, wax wax all up in your serving. Um, but uh, yeah. So yeah, that, that's rubbed in quite nicely. And then what I do, just to finish it off, I grab a, um, a little bit of uh, thread. Um, I'm just using a bit of spare serving here, but you know you can use anything really. But what you want to do is you want to wrap, just loop that round just the once, and then you're going to just drag that sort of slowly, evenly down the string. And what uh, what what you'll have there. Is you'll, you'll pull off wax, draw that down there, and you'll get a lot of excess wax on your string there. Uh, but what you've done is you've, you've taken all the, 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 the excess wax that you don't need off the string. I'll show you again. Um, so the, you don't need off the string, leaving you with a, a nicely coated, smooth string. And it makes it nice and round. I'll call it cabling. It makes it nice and nice and round. If you just rub the, if you just rub the uh, the wax in you sometimes get an uneven string where this is nice and even it's round all the way all the way down um, and then it's just a case of uh, rinse and repeat and uh, do the other side of the center serving so yeah that is just simply how to um, how to wax a bowstring nothing too complicated uh, it's just something that's going to really prolong the life of your string and i uh, i highly recommend it well i hope you have found that useful you take care shoot straight and i'll see you on the internet bye bye